Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Shannon Ashley here, and today we are doing a liquid lip swatch review. We are reviewing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of the LA Girl Matte Flat Finish Picnic Gloss. This, these are not a gloss at all, it's just matte, just so you know. I, I you guys just have to watch the video and see what you guys think about them. Um, comment as the video goes on. I do want to hear your honest to God true thought. But yeah, let's get right into this video. Go ahead and subscribe, like, all that jazz. But yeah, let's get right into this video. I line my lips with Cappuccino by NYX. This is dreamy. I know in past videos I used to say you shouldn't like go like that to do your lips, but I had a change of heart. I feel like when you it kind of distributes the lipstick across your lips more evenly and i just i don't know why i said that before it was an experience or maybe with my cup of tea i tried dreamy without a brown lip liner and it just really wasn't cutting it i feel like this is more appealing on my skin tone but yeah this is dreamy that was just one coat i can say guys that it does get very very cakey very fast and it sticks like Very sticky. Also, it's not that pretty by itself. I don't know if you guys can see. It, like, after it dries, it just doesn't distribute well. And, um, yeah, you definitely need, like, a chapstick underneath this, as well as maybe, um, just a different lipstick. <laughs> I don't know. I I don't know what I would wear this. Like, there's more creamier, better lipsticks, so. But on to the next one. Next, we have Floor, Flare. Not sure if that's how you say it, um, but I'm gonna go ahead and line my lips again. Okay, so this is Fleer Floor, and I used to be way more precise when applying lipstick, liquid lipstick, but I know I wear these quite a bit even though I haven't reviewed them yet. And because they go on so creamy, I feel like it's just best to just apply it and rub your lips together. These are really hard, in my opinion, to build just because they're so like liquidy and it kind of like, it becomes like real opaque real fast. So that's why I don't necessarily like evenly distribute them and wait for them to be evenly distri distributed. This one though is, did not apply well. Uh, I'm gonna go in and clean it up a bit. Yeah, this one is just a mess. Like, I'm trying to clean it up with the brown. Mm -mm. No, I'm, I'm not even going to try and like build this up and make it work and make it look pretty. This is floor and this one is a mess <laughs> by itself. Like whenever I wear this, I always put either chapstick at the bottom, a full layer of liquid lipstick or or a full layer of like liquid liner or like another liquid lipstick and layer this on top just because this by itself like I would never I would never like <laughs> not gonna get too close because I don't want to scare you guys but yeah no like no 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 all right guys <laughs> okay so what I have on my lips now is obsessed and um, <laughs> I'm not obsessed with it at all. I didn't even finish like applying it to my lips and letting it dry just because it's the same story. It goes on so creamy that it's like opaque the more that you rub it. 
and yeah like it's gonna dry like and get super cakey so because i want to get through this review i'm not gonna let it fully dry but um same thing i would apply this with or i'd wear this with a different lipstick of course not on its own just because <laughs> well, would you look at that um but yeah we're gonna go on to the next one <laughs> this is instinct okay so this one i tried to apply differently i took my time and applied it all over my lips then i and same thing it's getting on my teeth it's just kind of like a, just a hot mess i never i grabbed these but i never realized how much you need to layer these like these by themselves i don't know who can wear these by themselves but maybe my lips are too big maybe i need a really good lip scrub these by themselves are just terrible like i hope this camera is not making things look better than they actually are because okay i kind of jacked it up over here but all right let's just not look at this side like it's just not cute the color is everything though okay i have to film this one <laughs> I just, I've never used this one before, so I'm like, I have to film this. You guys have to see this one. Now we're doing this opaque thing again. <laughs> People are gonna be like, learn how to apply lipstick. First of all, mess. Mm-mm. <laughs> Mm-mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh no never i wish i could take myself seriously and it's not like you know let me back up so it doesn't look as bad another thing about these guys is the applicator stuck it's just like a stick with like some cotton around it or like i don't know no <laughs> no <laughs> no this is iconic and it's definitely not iconic on me <laughs> This smells so bad. This is Tole, which is a shame because ColourPop has one with the same name and it looks way better than this. <laughs> I don't, I think the light's not showing you guys how bad <laughs> this looks on my face. This is so bad. <laughs> and I'm not even like, I'm not even saying it's bad because like I'm looking at this with my iPhone right now and it looks way worse or it looks better than it does on my lips but you guys do not be confused like this this looks really bad <laughs> it's not showing on camera but it doesn't look good okay <laughs> okay this color is playful <laughs> How ironic. I was literally gonna like say this right off the bat, but I feel like a child playing in makeup right now. Like, let me scoot back so you guys can see. This is just making such a mess at this point, and like, I don't even care. I'll save my final reviews to the end. This is playful. It's not a game. It's not a joke. This is very, very bad. So bad. <laughs> okay, this one I am all about. This is the one and the only she's pretty stunning like this purple lipstick <laughs> like i i would wear this is pretty mm, very sticky very very sticky this is so pretty and this application went on a very well like if all of them were applied creamy and like non opaque like this one did but if you are looking for a $2 purple lipstick, here you go. One of the only ones from this collection that are worth it. This, I feel like this is just so pretty. Okay guys, now to the final one. This is probably the only one that I would wear by itself. Don't let me down now. This is Rebel. And just like Stunna, it goes on a so opaque. I'm sorry, it goes on so creamy and not opaque where like, 
you don't lose the color while you're applying it. This is so pretty. It's like you gotta go through, what is that saying? You gotta go through like a whole, as soon as I get done, you gotta kiss a lot of frogs before you meet your prince, if you know what I'm saying. So yeah, this one is very, very pretty. You can layer it on. I'll add one more layer just to show you guys how, how great this is. Yes, 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 yes. This one right here, if you were to pick up just this one from the store, you'd probably think all of them were just as good. <laughs> you'd be like me and you'd be wrong. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Of course, I don't have all the colors, thank God. But yeah, I hope you guys liked this lipstick try on and all my jokes and my laughs and me wiping lipstick off my teeth. Again, the two I recommend from this collection are Stunner and Rebel. These are my go-tos. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what was, which one was your fave. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.